Mercedes-Benz unveils its new seven-seater EQS SUV. I have driven the EQS sedan and loved it very much. And now I will look forward to driving the EQS SUV and bringing it to your attention, friends. So Mercedes-Benz has unveiled its new EQS SUV variant that will go on sale later this year. Mercedes has expanded its EQ line of electric vehicles with the new EQS SUV. The seven-seater luxury SUV starts at $130,000, more expensive than the EQS sedan, features an optional all-wheel drive system capable of 536 horsepower, has an estimated range of up to 410 miles, and can charge at a rate of 200 kilowatt via fast charger, 10 to 80% in up to 30 minutes. Mercedes we're looking to take the fight of the luxury sedan to the likes of Tesla and Lucid with their AQS sedan. But now they hope to challenge the likes of the Tesla Model X with its EQS SUV. The relatively spare seven-seater EV market makes the Mercedes an early contender in this market, but they are bringing a great option to the table. So what is it? Much like the EQS sedan, which I have reported and I will have the link in the description of this video, the SUV EQS is based on the vehicle is capable of incredible range, 410 miles when uh, per single charge, when equipped with the single motor rear wheel drive option. That's more than the sedan, of course. The SUV also also offers similar luxury features. An optional cross-dash display system with three screens, driver's center console, uh, and passenger. Optional rear wheel steering and all-wheel drive system boost horsepower to 536 horsepower, up from 355 in the single motor. And a 200 kilowatt capable charging system means that Mercedes can charge the SUV, um, uh, electric EQS SUV, uh, 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 charge the enormous SUV's enormous 107.8 kilowatt hour battery in just 30 minutes to 80%. So let me repeat that again. So the 200 kilowatt hour capable charging system means that Mercedes can charge the EQS SUV's huge 107.8 kilowatt hour battery in just 30 minutes to 80 percent that means you can get like 380 390 miles per uh, uh, in within 30 minutes of charging in a similar trend to other legacy car makers like cadillac Mercedes has made the new EQS SUV enormous. The vast SUV stretches over 16.5 feet long and weighs an earth-shattering 7,716 pounds. But with that size comes all of the luxury interior features you can expect from a vehicle with a starting price of $100,000. Massaging and heated, uh, massaging and heated seats for all passengers, displays available for every car Z year being taken to soccer practice, and Mercedes iconic interior lighting systems draping over the interior. It is clear the target of the Mercedes EQS SUV the Ma is Tesla Model X, and the vehicle certainly does its best to outshine its American counterpart Tesla Model X. So it's kind of Mercedes EQS SUV versus the Model X. The EQS SUV has more range, more passenger space, especially in the third row, and more comfort amenities for passengers. However, it is substantially less powerful than the comparably priced Tesla Model X Plaid. At the same time, Mercedes is undoubtedly working on an AMG variant that will go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Tesla's uh, huge vehicle. However, Tesla will not be the only manufacturer looking to enter the seven-seater market with electric vehicles. Keep that in mind. Tesla is likely looking to update its long-in-the-tooth vehicle lineup. Hyundai and Kia are both looking for bringing a large seven-seater option to market. BMW is likely working on an iX7 to complement its current five-seater option. And Lucid's Project Gravity is in the works as well. In fact, speaking of Lucid, I just reported earlier today that Lucid today introduced a new electric vehicle, the uh, Lucid Air Sapphire EV. Anyway, let's move on. So not for not to forget Ford and GM 
who are long dominated the gargantuan SUV market with the likes of the Ford Expedition, Lincoln Navigator, Chevy Suburban and Cadillac Escalade. This will be an exciting market to watch in the coming years, speaking of electric vehicles or seven-seaters cars. So what do you think about the Mercedes EQS SUV that is going to be in on sale later this year? This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news. Ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage. God bless you, everyone. Peace be with all of you. And like this video if you found the information helpful. I'll see you soon in our next report.